Hello everyone and welcome back to today's video. Today we are checking out the complex gaming server here on Minecraft. It's been about a month since I've done our last server review. So I decided it was time for another one and this server was suggested by some viewer um, and they were like, hey, why don't you check out the server? It's pretty popular. So I was like, okay, well, let's, why not? Let's check out what they have. Um, so we're here in the hub and it seems like you have a good number of players on 1,200. That's insane. This is actually a pretty big server. Um, but it does seem like 771 of them are on Pixelmon, 400 are on Vanilla, and um, Feed the Beast, I think, is FTB, so that's 25. Um, so, very cool, indeed. Um, so you can see there's, like, Fossil Tech. Oh, that's a mod point. Okay, so that's Fossil Tech. That's that's the thing, not Feed the Beast. I, I clearly am too old um, to know what's going on anymore. Um, so that's kind of interesting. Uh, you have a leaderboard for the parkour at spawn. You got Pixelmon servers, so you have a lot of Pixelmon servers, so that seems like it's different versions or different things, so you have a, yeah, that's pretty cool. And then I guess this is vanilla, so I guess if you use a server selector, yeah, okay, so this is like vanilla, you have your store, Discord, website, vote, installs, and the overall server IP. So vanilla servers is what we're going to check out here, hub selector and player visibility, so you don't have any cosmetics or anything, that's alright. I am only on 1.8. Um, and it looks like you have no vanilla servers that run 1.8. So it looks like I'm going to have to switch versions to check out any of your servers. Um, no, I can... Interesting. So it looks like you have Via Rewind or something running on here. Because I was able to join, but I'm on 1.8. So maybe make your signs correct on what versions can be used for different things. So this is like creative, I guess. Um, yeah, I can fly, so I'm in creative. PG, so slash PG, nice. Can I create a plot? Click to create a new plot. Here we go. Okay, I have a plot. So like all servers that have creative, I just leave a sign. Let's put a sign down. You have head database. Interesting. It doesn't really, I can't open any menu. Slash tools, go paint. Okay, so you at least have one Oh, that's cool. You have like a custom world edit thing. Anyway, all right, let's set this to sign sub to PGHD dev on YT. There we go. We left our mark here. So, warning any redstone will not function because you don't have a rank. So, you seem to, it seems redstone is required um, for the rank. And my ID is negative three. Um, so, I don't know what that's about. But let's go back to hub. Creative isn't really anything I can kind of review or anything. Um, so let's go ahead and check your other servers. So it says it was 1.16, but I'm running on 1.8. Um, same with this. So your factions has a resource pack, but your resource pack seems to... Your starter swords don't seem to work in your resource pack. So that's something I would check out um, and try to fix. Postman. So every, there, there seems to be like Chinese characters and stuff, or I don't know if they're supposed to be those characters. My guess is maybe your resource pack is having issues, unless this is like a, it's designed to be like that. Um, so a lot of your stuff is erroring with different um, resource pack stuff. So something's up with your resource pack, because players have a bunch of stuff that um, the resource pack is uh, erroring out. So you have a nice little scoreboard, you have the rules, maybe make this so you can't spam the rules. Stuff like that. I think it's pretty nice. I'm not the biggest. We got leaderboards. Yeah, there's for sure something wrong with the resource pack because there's supposed to be other uh, items there. Uh, no box available. So I would make this a little bit more customized compared to like a high pixel style. Um, just so you don't have to deal with that. Faction crates. Let's see. Do these bounce you back? They do not. So congratulations on doing the one thing that I hate above all servers is bouncing back crates. So great job on that. Thank you for not doing that. Um, but yeah, it looks pretty cool other than the resource timer thing. Um, and then your scoreboard does look cool too. It's a little small uh, compared to other ones I've seen. But um, overall, pretty cool indeed. Reset vault items can be saved in your resource vault. Oh, that's cool. So you can actually save stuff for after the map resets. So that's pretty nice. You can save some stuff. Very cool, unique ID there. ID? Ideal? Idea? Idea. That's the word. I am clearly still in my finals brain at the moment. Um, Skyblock. Let's go to Skyblock. Check it out. Um, I would kick for the Skyblock. So, maybe I, I have a feeling that you seem to be logged in already. I am clearly not logged in already. Um, so I was kicked from Skyblock and I can't rejoin the server. So, I guess that's the end of the server review. A little bit shorter than I would have liked. 
Um, but I would make sure, rather than kicking you for scoreboard length because you're not on a newer version, it doesn't let you join in the first place, so you don't run into the problem where you can't actually rejoin the server due to some off thing you have going on here. So, thank you so much for watching today's video. Hopefully, you did enjoy. Um, and I'll see you in the next video, I think, in two days. So, thanks so much for watching. See you next time. Bye, everybody.